Always great to find a good deal on designer fashions. But when that deal seems just too good to be true, it probably is. Our right, news reporter Miriam Hernandez shows us what police found when they raided the notorious Santee Alley today. It's all new at 6. Vendors are stocked for the holidays. The cutest stuff, the trendy names. Flowing from a bebe, cow counterfeit, DKNY. We have affliction. These items, though, won't make it to your shopping bag. They are knockoffs, and the dealers are busted. Sheriff's deputies have been working undercover to conduct similar sweeps over the last several months. It was involving multi-jurisdictions, including agencies from out of state, and it was targeting counterfeiters uh, in and around the Los Angeles area. Investigators are keeping a lid on what they uncovered. The sheriff plans to reveal the findings of this operation tomorrow. Expect details of a network more elaborate than any found before. Deputies showed us some of the loot they found today. Labels such as Coach, um, Chanel, Tunienberg, Dolce Gabbana. Some of the hottest items are jewelry. Look at all the designer names here. Bulgari, Louis Vuitton, Chanel, Coach. What they'll try and do is something called an infringement, not necessarily a counterfeit. They'll just put the logo on here and they'll think, oh, okay, since I didn't write baby fat on it, it's not counterfeit. Well, Baby Fat has trademarked this, this cat, so that, of course, is a counterfeit. Counterfeit sellers are becoming more savvy, keeping their fakes hidden. They'll put the Lakers t-shirt, but if you keep flipping, bam, Tommy Hilfiger. There is also evidence the vendors are making some fakes themselves. The companies, too, are losing out on billions of dollars, and especially in time of this, you know, this recession that we have, every dollar counts. The underground business steals from the public, too. The dealers work in cash, and they don't pay taxes. It is so lucrative, the counterfeit business is expanding. Toothpaste, batteries, and Viagra are carted off, along with Louis Vuitton. Miriam Hernandez, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Well, a lot of smiling faces at Jefferson Elementary.